There's a glint to your eyes that I recognize from the bathroom mirror. Oh, God. You've walked Kingsmith's secret You're trails, yes? a little yes? close there. What was it your like? Breath smells like? Was geez. it illuminating? Were you enlightened? If it weren't for circumstance and my duty to the Lord, I would join you, document your expedition. Yep. Although, those are not the only paths. Some run deeper, more hidden. Tap your foot on any paving stone down Main Street, and you might hear the echo of Illuminati history. Oh yes, Solomon Priest and Isaac Fletcher put this soil to work when they raised Kingsmouth above and below. Why, the whole of Solomon County is positively riddled with tunnels. But I wouldn't expect most people to notice. They're too enclosed by their simple lives to comprehend the secret world around them, below them. You can't stop now. I know that feeling intimately. Ah. The desire to keep digging. That glint won't fade. The restlessness in your heart won't slow. The voices won't fall silent. Wait. Dig further. Dig deeper. Always deeper. No. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Never. That was the creepiest you've been, and that's saying something. There are so many words that a person should never say. But he said voices. Is he hearing voices too, I wonder? I'm sure he's hearing all kinds of voices. He said stomp paving stones down Main Street. And, uh, wait a minute. Hold on. I, you probably didn't even pick that up on your feet. I was a little distracted by the zombies. That was before they, they got to me. Just a second before them. Hold on a second. Where was it? There, here. Here. Can't hear that? Probably can't. No, I think I could... It was a quiet, kind of like, thunking sound. There. Did you just pick up an entire section of sidewalk and move it out of the way? Holy shit. You didn't even notice you were doing it. I did not. Clavis Aria. Um, means golden key. Well, I mean, it wasn't really held down very well. It's the sidewalk. I mean, like, it wasn't secured at all. Someone had to have noticed that. Oh, right, everyone on this town is in on it. Except for the sheriff, apparently. Golden key, you say? It can't be that easy. I don't think this is how the key to the city works, but fuck it, let's go with it. Okay. Nice of you to put it back. Yeah. Okay, this... This is... This looks a lot older than, you know, some of the other places I've been. This is definitely an Illuminati labyrinth. This looks old. It's got electricity. Yeah, that's not really saying much. I mean, that just puts... That just means it's been retrofitted. That's true, but that means someone was down here. Plus, you know, these look like the, uh... These look like those hundred-year bulbs. Oh, yeah, yeah, we have so many of those. I don't know how that one got out of the firehouse. But... A man who seeks enlightenment shall set himself in motion. Herself. It, it was the 1800s. She shall show... Okay, that, that gets hard to say. <laughs> She shall sh I can't imagine saying that with a lisp. <laughs> she shall show appreciation for the exertion of his fellow. Go ahead. <laughs> I'll let you finish this. Oh god, I'm And make a church going man doth before the holy thimbles. He shall so great disdain for the trappings of old empire and avert his gaze from 
This game's coiled and chaotic. Oh god, my speech therapist would kill me if she heard me talking like that. Well, here we are in a maze of twisty little passages, all alike. Uh, I go south. Oh, I forgot to look first. I forgot you always want to look first, because you miss it. Yeah. I never did do well. Because I can tell you which way to go, you know? Yeah, you, you don't know where the exits are until you look. Of Khufu of the Grand Lodge. Well, Khufu was an Egyptian. And the Grand Lodge of the Masons. I don't think we have anything for the, Ma for the Masons, though, do we? I don't think we do. At least nothing that shape. Put Masonic symbol shaped hole in the. No, fuck, I fucked it up. I could never get E flask. Oculus Rara Avis. Eyes? Bird. I don't know, need to know what Rara means. That's rare, rare bird. Look, rare bird. <laughs> Yeah, why not? I mean... Or maybe it's like, LOOK! Rare bird! You know, Latin bird watching. Oh, that... Something is just not right about that thing. Uh... Well, I looked away and I didn't move, so... What does this say? Well, it's too... too faded to actually read, I guess. Rub it over like a big, long sheet of butcher paper that I'm sure you have. Well, let's see who's buried here. Saw him, he saw him priest, and, um... You gotta find the silver tongue of Jebediah Springfield. Huh. A confession. Penned the year under the eye, 1702. Kingswith Town. One might consider this an admission to two acts of cowardice and also of bad faith within the enlightened order. Illuminati, right? Yeah. And as such, I shall see to it that this missive, once written, is sequestered within with sequestered with my own corpse. My time on this earth now short, and much is left to be undertaken. By this I mean the order and by our third, but more on that, a piece. Our third? The remains of Solomon Priest were moved at my instruction by loyal men, who fashioned for him a new rest within the tunnels. On this matter, I declare my reasoning was to prevent our enemies and consorts alike from digging too deeply. The trail to the new tomb shall die with my retainers and myself, and so too shall die any looters or gawker seeking to negotiate its traps, should they not hold enlightened knowledge. TLDR, I'm dead. Fuck you. I'm dead. I moved Solomon Priest's body because reasons. But who was the third he was talking about? Of uh, Khufu? Uh, of the Grand Lodge. Well, this looks newer. No. I mean, that looks like magical flame. It's... Oh yeah, it does. It's very nice effect. Terrible yeah. to read by, though. Also, these books look to be molder beyond any value. Doesn't keep the mold off him. Nope. To proceed right as a learned man would, look to Jerome's work on the two score and first psalm, the eighth part, the first darkness. Jerome, the twenty-first psalm, first part, the eighth darkness. What? Well, Latin. I remember my high school Latin. 
You took high school Latin. Yes. <laughs> I was not a popular girl. No, yeah, well, okay, I, I'm with you there. <laughs> Except the girl part. Not the least of which, because the Latin club made us do the Heil salute. Oh, wow! It was. It's a long story. I mean, I get. They probably come to think of it, they probably don't do that anymore. We had to say Hail Caesar, but you know. What does the German class do? <sighs> okay. Moving on, but remembering. Oh, I see. They wanted. Oh, I see. Wait a second. Maybe they wanted in Latin. Jerome, and Jerome. Latin for darkness would be. Um, Jerome wrote in Latin the eighth part, the first. So what? What? What was the line? What was the, the clue again? The first, on the two score in first psalm. Oh wait, two two score. I'm looking at the wrong. I'm looking at the wrong psalm. Forty <laughs> first psalm, the eighth part, the first darkness. Here we go. Abyssus. Yeah, that's what I was going to guess. A. Well, let's see. Now we're going to the name of God. But an Aramaic. Jehovah begins with a Y. A B Y S. Um. Uh, U. Uh, oh no! Crap! Crap! Can I? <laughs> okay. Latin class. Stickler for proper spelling. I told you it was high school, right? Yeah. It's been a long time since high school, hasn't it? What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. Like, um, five years, maybe? Yeah, let's, let's at least make it realistic. Ten years? There we go. Ten years going on seven. Yeah. Wait, what? Try jumping. Well, that worked. And I guess, uh, walk backwards. Wow, this is really obtuse. Well, welcome to the Illuminati. Oh, no. Is that a pipe organ? Oh, no. <laughs> I do not do good with music. Uh, do you remember that one uh, part of Mist that you could only get by solving a musical a musical puzzle? Oh my god. I don't. To be honest, I never played Mist. I played Shivers. What was it? Was that like an asylum version of Mist? No, it was Sierra. Back when Sierra made games. Wasn't Mist also Sierra? No, 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 this was a. Uh, I don't know who missed was, yeah. but no. no. No, it was like you were trapped in this museum and there were things that jumped out at you and you had to, like, capture them in jars. And it was actually a pretty cool game. That actually does sound pretty cool. I wonder if it's on, like, GOG or Steam or something. Anyway. But anyway, yes. there was one part that I could only pass by turning on the. Because um, if, you, if you turn on uh, subtitles. It assumes you're deaf, and so then when it plays the musical puzzle, it gives you actually a score, you know. Mm. Oh, that's... that was, and I still failed it many times. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Mist did not do that. I had to, I had to just use the, you know, cheesing it by using all this the super secret cheat ending of Mist. Weep not for thyself, but for Dolandi. The first. God, this is. I thought it was pretty well read, but God. I don't know any of this stuff. Oh, and that makes it easy. There's a song by Dolandi called Flow My Tears. That sounds like it might be a clue. Could be it. Can you find this particular part? Yes, let me see. 
I mean, because if they want me to play the whole thing. Okay, I think I found it. Um, this doesn't have sharp notes. I don't even know what a sharp note is. I know that much. I mean, I. So. I guess he doesn't want us to play this part. Because we literally couldn't. Or maybe that's the part he does want us to play. Oh god, we can't. I mean, oh, we really no. can't. Oh, I'm so, okay. Oh. I thought you meant the I thought you meant the blackout one. Alright. Well let me find let me find the sheet music here. Can you bring that back up? Okay, I've got it. It's, um... I have no idea how to translate, how to read music. Uh. Okay, so... Okay, so I've looked, I've, I've looked up, like, musical notation for dummies. So I'm pretty sure that's, um, the white head and an A. Okay. And uh, the next one is it's like a white head but with a bowl near the side of it. And that one uh pretty sure that's geez, did the did the letters go up or just go up or down? Um yeah, that's an E. All right, so far not dead. All right. Um Then there's one of the black heads. For the record, it's the ones that are black for you are white for me. Oh. Oh shit. Okay, yeah, sorry. It's But I already didn't doing, doing that translation in my head, so uh, I'll change. Yeah. And uh, that's another E. And then the last two are both the black head and a G. Wait. No, that, that's the white head. I mean, the fuck. Did you go solid or fill? Solid. Solid or, solid or empty? You're right, that would have been much better. So yeah, solid G. Your rapper name? No, my rapper name is MC Loud. Okay, let's see here. So what's next? Uh, the same one again. God, imagine like thousands of years from now and the Illuminati are making puzzles based on my humps. I'm pretty sure that won't be considered classical music. Look, you you know someone's gonna do it. You you've seen KG's musical preferences. Oh wait, no, she likes old yeah. she likes old school hip hop, yeah. Yeah, like the you She'll know. base it off gin and juice or something. Mama said knock you out? Yeah, there we go. You get it. To solve the puzzle, you must re you must recite "Rapper's Delight" by the Sugar Hill Gang. You must identify the real Slim Shady. <laughs> yes. Okay. So, um, no guidance here. Wait a second. Wasn't there? Something about a yeah, yeah, that book, the book. What does the book say? There was definitely something about a serpent. Yeah, 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 the book. With your, I'm sorry, your, I don't remember your lisp distracted me. Okay, let's try it again. Um, he shall sh a man who seeks enlightenment shall set himself in motion. He shall show appreciation for the exertions of his fellows. 
and make as a church-going man does before holy symbols. He shall, he shall show great disdain for the trappings of old empire, and avert his gaze from schemes coiled and chaotic. Hmm. Show appreciation for exertions? Wow. Oh, they've got the clapper. Huh. And... Oh, this statue again. It's a popular design. I like the, the big spear thing. It's like a sword spear. Yeah. I think there's a name for that. I don't know what it is. Only a boar hunting spear? Uh, probably. Oh, I, th I think it's called a... Uh, oh, it's just called a Svard Staff. Oh, huh? Clever. Thanks, Sweden. Okay, so may make is the... Uh... Make is a churchgoer before the holy symbols. A penitent man kneels before God. Let us pray. Oh, come on! Well, did that not work? That should have worked. Ugh. Welcome back, lungs. Oh, now this will be now reset. Man, these things are so formal. It's like meeting the queen. You can't, you know, you can't turn away from them. You can't use the wrong spoon. You can't say, "Hey, what up, girl." Otherwise, they spray venom at you. Yes, the queen will do that. Or from her venom sacks. Yes, from her venom sacks. You're not being sarcastic, are you? I am not being sarcastic. Now, see, now it works. And well, the process of elimination tells me this. They wanted to make sure you were really sorry. Sorry? Look, we've already established I'm Canadian. It's... How do you say it? Sorry? That's what I said. Sorry. No, you said sorry. Yeah, yeah that's what I said. No, no, no. It's sorry. Sorry! Sorry. Sorry. All right. Now we have moved on. Now let's see. This is the real coffin of Solomon Priest, and here's this guy. To the second part, then, the reason for this deception is that I did take the man's life. Ooh, all true. I did poison him as the rumors have long circulated, and likely shall continue. For truly, it was less an act of murder as of martyring, and though I assumed his duties, I performed them with hollow ritual. And as his name is remembered, mine remains in his considerable shadow. In the one score years since my fateful act, I have come to accept this was always my rightful place, and in seeking to unseat him, I did only seal its forevermore. The third knew of my treachery, and of this I am certain even though he remained in London. Now, finally, as I breathe my last, he comes to America with designs for the Order in New York. Who is this third? I don't know. Isaac Fletcher. It's apparently very big in the Illuminati history. Also, I just realized something. Mm -hmm. In the 1700s, they capitalized like Tumblr. <laughs> Yeah, they did. I mean, I can't be the only one to notice that. They were very important words. Yeah, I could hear the capitalization <laughs> when you said that. 
What are you, internal affairs? Allow me to satisfy any future curiosity you may have about the contents of our closets. They are full of dead guys. Try to understand. In the early days of Sullivan Island, we were reestablishing and modernizing. Success called for stability and corporate order. If that meant burying certain acts of jealousy, so be it. Of course, some historical facts are more sensitive than others. Do your best to forget any mention of a third in all this. Digging into that little tidbit would likely get the attention of the magicians. Fun fact, magicians do more than magic. They make people disappear. So how do you feel about digging into that little tidbit? I'm not in any hurry at the moment, but yeah. Let's just leave it at that.